Chief? <laughs> Can you hear us up there? Yeah! yeah. Woo! Woo! This poem is for Mayor Larry O'Brien. Woo! Yeah! Woo! <laughs> AKA Lion O'Brien. <laughs> AKA the Bald Goblin. <laughs> AKA Lex Luthor. <laughs> AKA Skeletor without the hood. <laughs> you big fat cat aristocrat bourgeois bigot. My people are not pigeons. Oh! <laughs> See, we try to be peaceful spoken poets, but sometimes when the fire's blaze inside, you gotta show it. So this one's for all the politicians sitting, bellies bloated. And certain copper rules that only ever get more eroded. I read the news for some time between the lines is where I've noted. A type of crime that declined and disclosed before we voted. But in most of the people's minds, the message sent is rather coded. So I took as a sign to write rhyme to get your mind exploded. See along the same whitewashed middle class lines how we're molded. Believing this country began when the first white man ro ro rolled in. But what I'm told is much different than what's quoted in our records of past epochs. I know these streets are built on bloodshed, intentionally spread smallpox as well as soil and rocks that belong to someone else. To build our mansion, we bulldoze the brother's long house and smash his democracy. Force him to schools under theocracy, rejected by autocracy, be weapon of hypocrisy, masquerading his truth. Like a peace tower housing the people who send our youth to the fronts. And a flame that's eternal except every couple of months when we ride. When Harvard is home, boys, pray to the Lord Jesus for some peace and quiet. When we in the police make sure they never get what they desire. Because we won't shut our mouths and then we keep running fire. We'll keep calling them liars and making them fear we. Because we scribble and write the right questions and queries like, hmm. Why would they rather build footbridges than feed the poor? Why is it that the down and up and the women folk are always ignoring? Why are they spending billions to gentrify the downtown core? So we normal folks can admire the pretty pads we can't afford. That's what we spin these homophobes and all goblins. We elected to run this multicolored mountain culture. We call Ottawa, though it's built on land that's Algonquin. A pretty pretty la there, it tastes as a small or monkey. And if wrong is perceived, we'll be the first to speak. Like sisters are so broke, they sell their booties on that woozy. And brothers who yearn for escape, so they drink 40s until they're woozy. Life in this city can be as confusing as hell. You get a tear gas shower if you choose to rebel. On Sussex and the Hill, they thought to build more prisons, more suburbs, more cells. Until they are green spaces, the last streets are fell. Yes, this is where we dwell. For some, it's their lights in heaven. But for most, it's hell. Or at least just, just barely surviving. Common people breaking their backs, striving for the ever elusive dollar to be spent. While the masses build up their riches from our labor and consent. To be free from this bondage must be our only intent. I try to organize my people to make the wicked ones repent. Cause I don't think the system is uncontestable, unquestionable, I haven't said. Cause what's divine is a profit from each tragic event. Like single mothers on the city streets cause they can't pay rent. And native peoples whose hard times never relent. And too many immigrants whose deathbeds have been the cement. Thanks to the police backed by the teachers who keep our minds impotent. So the politicians can fuck around with no consequences. It's senseless. How we Udoans are kept complacent, ignorant, and defenseless. And the most of us who know the deal won't get off our fences. So we'll spend our days writing bitter elegies to lament this. And getting trained to face the pigs when the action commences. <laughs> yeah.